Greetings, brothers and sisters in Helios. It is I, High Priest Lazulian, Contact Nalhuda Palmarian, here to tell you about our latest monument to Helios on the planet Oyakov Beta. This planet is already home to some of the most astonishing monuments to the glory of Helios ever created, and the planet itself is stunningly fecund and wild. However, what struck me from the very first moment on landing on the planet was the caves. I have traveled all over multiple galaxies spreading the glory of Helios, and never have I seen their equal. There are caves large enough to fly a ship through. I was exploring with several acolytes when we found an immense underground cave with no direct surface access. Imagine my shock when we discovered creatures living down there. I quickly realized that these creatures had possibly lived out their entire existence bereft of the light of Helios. Our God himself must have guided my steps so that I would discover these poor unfortunate wretches and bring them salvation. Construction finished mere days ago, and the altar is open to pilgrims from all galaxies, not just the cave dwellers of this specific planet. So come with me, and let me show you what myself and my acolytes have wrought. The pilgrim's journey starts at the opening of the cave system, where a roamer waits to transport them to the door of the penitent. Once through the teleporter on the opposite side of the door, the pilgrims find themselves in a dead-end cave, with stairs leading up to the Hall of Purpose. As they traverse the Hall of Purpose, anticipation builds until the doors at the end open and they get their first glimpse of the altar. After making their way up the ramp, they are able to view the altar in all of its glory.
After placing their offerings on the altar, the teleporter on the left will take them back to the surface so that they might call their ship and go tell others about the time they worshipped the sun god while underground. Now, brothers and sisters, notice that all offerings placed on the altar slide down into a hidden teleporter. This takes them to a slightly larger dead-end cave that we have converted into a storehouse for all the offerings left by the pilgrims. This room is visible but inaccessible from the teleporter behind the door of the penitent. So come and visit the altar today. I challenge any of you to come sit in the presence of this altar and not feel closer to our God.